Funny how the wheel of fashion turns full circle. This is the first real MG, affectionately known as Old Number no. 1, and built in 1925. And it's this car which really gave the masses the concept of the affordable sports car. 68 years on, the illustrious name of MG is alive and well, in the form of the new MGR V8. And I'm very pleased to be able to tell you that Rover Cars have given Top Gear an exclusive test drive in this pre-production prototype. So let's see how it compares with its forebears. Apart from a softly curved, bewitching new body, there's a palatial wooden leather dressed interior, a grunty 3.9 litre fuel injected V8 and a five speed gearbox. The MGR V8 is everything the old MGB V8 should have been but never was. Make no mistake about it, this is a real MG, the best ever. A proper, proper sports car to stiffen the sinews and summon up the blood. To drive it is to love it. It's a delightfully disarming little car. Very quick with knife-sharp acceleration, yet refined and smooth riding. But it still oozes that period charm which made the old MGB one of the best-selling sports cars in the world. No, the new MGR V8 is a real burster. But will it sell? Well, Rovers seem to think so, and they've taken so far 100 deposits, even though at 26,500 it hardly continues the tradition of the affordable sports car. While enthusiasts like this may feel warm approval at the thought of a new MG, they can't help but have noticed that for the same amount of money, you could buy four MGs, the complete set. Imagine, do you buy an MGB V8 and an MGC and an MGB and an MGA? or a single MGR V8. Now there's a delightful dilemma.